for this exercise, begin laying on the floor with your knees bent and heels on an elevated surface. That can be a couch, box, bench, chair, step, whatever you've got access to. Just make sure that it's stable so it's not going to move as you begin to move. And it's not so high that your knees have to rise above 90 degrees. So how I have them like just a little bit less than 90 is great. Um, you could go a little bit lower, but we definitely don't want to have them too high to where we're having to really reach up to get our legs up there. Okay, from here, bend one knee even more and lift your heel. Your arms can be bent or straight by your side. Tuck your chin down so that you're looking over your knees. From here, we'll inhale. And now exhale, we're gonna press our heel directly down as we lift our hips directly up and squeeze our butt. Exhale, lift up, knees at 90 degrees and now lower back down with control. A couple other notes on form here. We wanna make sure that our hip is not rocking, our hips aren't rocking side to side. So if you like to actually keep your fingers on the two bony parts of your hip, that's great. You can do that first to make sure that you don't have one side kind of lagging or moving around and rotating your pelvis. All right, we got that going. Now we also wanna make sure that our back is not arching. We don't need to go into hyperextension here. We're just lifting up to a place where we can keep our core engaged. We're feeling our glutes, we're feeling our hamstrings, and we have a straight line from knee to hip to shoulder when we're at the top, right? That nice straight line going on. And from here, we'll inhale, lower down, exhale. Be sure to hold for one, two at the top. Look at that squeeze going and continue. 